Hi, my name is Suzanne Peterson, and I'm going to talk to you about seven tips for night photography. Step one is shutter speed, and I'm going to show you a little example with this. So what you want to do is set your camera to manual, and then you're going to go in and set your shutter speed between one second and six seconds. Um, find something that you're comfortable with and then go with that. And you're going to need a flashlight for this. So I'm going to turn off the light and I'm going to show you. So when you set off your camera, you're going to do this. You want to wave your flashlight around and then make a design, write your name, do whatever. So you just wave it around and then after that you should get a pretty awesome photo. Um, next step, step two, you want to use different lighting. Um, you can use a candle, you can use the light from your refrigerator, just find something that's different and then work with that. Um, step three is you want to use a tripod. Because uh, some of these, um, with your shutter speed being so long, you're going to end up with a lot of blurry pictures. So you want to definitely use a tripod for some of these pictures because you want to get that sharp picture for yourself. Um, step four is go outside, like at night. Don't be afraid to go outside. Um, capture what happens at night. I mean, there are some great things that happens at night. Um, go for a drive. Go take a picture of moving cars. But with this, you want to wait. You don't want to do it like when it's dark. You want to wait till it's more dusk to do this. So you have a little bit more light, and you still get that great picture of those moving cars. Um, step five is get creative. I mean, this is the whole point is to have fun. Um, show what you can do. I mean, this is a learning process. Step six is, since this is a learning process, is you're going to have a lot of trial and errors. I mean, that's normal with any part of photography. Um, you are going to learn, you're going to hate it, but at the same time, you're going to love it because you're going to find something new, you're going to learn a new skill, and that's always great. Um, step seven is use this for weddings. I mean, this is great to use for weddings. Um, you can use sparklers, you can use the outdoor lighting that they have. I mean, this will make great wedding pictures that the couple will have forever. So thank you so much for watching.